Anchor Laguna! There's someone here to see you! Huh? Me? What's this person look like? He was wearing funny clothes. He's talking to Wayne right now. Hmm. Is he at the pub? Yep. That's why I came to get you, Uncle Daguna. Am I a good girl? No, you're not. It's dangerous to be out there by yourself. What if a monster comes and attacks you? It's only next door. It's okay. It's still dangerous. And since you're such a cute little girl, the monsters will especially be after you. They'll catch you, and then they'll suckle your blood out. If anything like that should happen, Uncle Laguna's gonna cry. I'll be okay. I just call you, Uncle Laguna. You can rescue me, right? H hey! Alone! Wait! I waited. Am I a good girl? Yes, a good girl. Dear Alone's father and mother, Alone's been a good girl today. Right? Yep. Alone! Now's your chance! Chance! You understand alone? Now go to your room and play. I got in trouble. That's because you broke your promise. Too bad. Laguna, use proper English when speaking to alone. I got in trouble. Too bad. <laughs> it's been a while, Laguna. Kairos! He's Uncle Laguna's friend. He dresses funny. But he's not a bad guy. You seem well. Yeah, you too. Hey, how long has it been? You know, our grand escape from Sentra? That was... One would usually call that being chased out. I thought so. Well, I would say about a year or so. I was bedridden for over six months. It seemed like every bone in my body was in pieces. I nursed him back to health. Thank you for taking good care of Laguna. I was able to recover in about a month or so. Ever since then, I've been searching for you. Why? After leaving the army, well, just killing time, I guess. Life's pretty boring without you as entertainment, my man. That's a harsh thing to say. I've been living a productive life here. I think I understand what you mean, though. So, what do you want to know? Let's see. What's Ward up to? How's Ward doing? Ward quit the army too. Luckily, he found a job, and he's working pretty hard. What's he doing? He's a janitor down at the D District prison. Wow! Can't picture him mopping floors, but I'm glad he's doing well. Oh. And he never got his voice back. You could basically tell what he wants from his facial expressions.
How's Julia doing? I don't know. You mean Julia, the singer? That's right. Laguna really admired her, and always frequented the nightclub. Shut up! So what if I did? Julia used to sing in a nightclub? No, she didn't sing. She just played the piano. And the first song she released was Eyes On Me. Hey, how does the song go? You don't know? Well, you never let me hear it. I didn't think you'd listen to music. The song's about being in love. I really like it. Heard she recently got married. Oh yeah. To some army general, right? General Carraway or something. I'm not too sure. I read in a magazine that her true love went off to war and never came back. General Carraway comforted her while she was feeling down. That's how they got to know each other. So she didn't wait for the soldier to come back. So what? Who cares? As long as she's happy, right? That's all that matters. Ain't that right, Ellie? Right! Uncle Laguna and Raina. Ah! Okay, enough talk about this. I think the fairies are here. Fairies? Yeah, I guess so. Then our work today should be a cinch. I'm looking forward to the battles. Let's talk later. Time to do some work. Okay. So, what's your plan? You gonna stick around here for a bit, right? Would that be okay? You work for what you eat. If that's fine with you, you're more than welcome. Laguna, I have a simple question. What exactly do you do here? It's like this. All the working men in this town were sent off to war. The only ones that are still left in town are old people, children, chocobos, dogs, and cats. And I'm sure you've noticed, but the monsters have made their way into town. This here town took real good care of me. So basically, I want to return the kindness. You're looking at the monster hunter of Windhill. So as of today, you'll be my assistant. We're to patrol the town, up to the town entrance. If we see anyone in need along the way, we help them. That's our basic duty. All right, our first patrol complete. We're to report to the commander and assistant commander. Commander? You mean that woman at the pub? Her name's Rain. Rain, okay? She saved my life. And the assistant commander is alone. 
She seems like a really nice person, but easily taken in by a hotshot. A hotshot? Okay, let's step up our patrol a notch. Assistant Karas, let's come up with a plan after we get back to the base. Hey, Laguna. Are you doing this patrol thing every day? Thing? What are you calling thing? Weren't you aiming to become a world-traveling journalist? You've heard of Timber Maniacs, right? I had a talk with the chief editor. He said he's interested in any article related to world travel. That's great! We should go talk to him sometime. Uh, yeah. Um, it'd be okay if we stayed here a bit longer, right? You need time to gather more material. This seems like a really nice town. You're gonna write about this place first, aren't you? No way! Can't make this place famous. Too much publicity, and you get all those tourists and stuff. You're afraid someone might come and take Rain away. Laguna, you've changed, man. Hey, I see a monster! Girl talk. Let's come back later. Come on. Something inside me tells me to listen. Rain, aren't you going to marry Uncle Laguna? A guy like that. He was carried in here crying like a baby, and I was the one who had to take care of him. His crude way of speaking, I don't know if his aspirations as a journalist are true. Every time I have a serious conversation, he avoids- I can't stand him snoring, and he talks in his sleep. But, he's really nice. I really, really like him. Rain, Uncle Laguna, and Ellie should all be together. But you know... I think what he really wants to do is travel all over the world. I don't think he has it in him to live in a quiet country town like this one. Some people are like that. Oh, it makes me so mad. You don't like him? I feel the same as you alone. Oh. Yeah, you're back! <laughs> I came back in a hurry! Report to the commander. Here's my report on today's patrol and monster extermination. 
including Butcher Butcher Bush and Bun Buns that Assistant Commander alone oh so hates. I've exterminated four monsters. Alright. Thank you. Shall we eat before you go started with your next patrol? I'll call you when it's ready. So just wait in your room. You seem pretty tired. You should take a quick nap. Time for a little break. Well now, so we rest up a bit. Hmm, what's the matter? I get scared sometimes. Scared of waking up somewhere else. Scared of not seeing alone. Scared of not seeing rain? What happened to me? I feel... What is this I'm feeling? Oh, please let it be this room when I wake up. Please let me be in this puny bed when I wake up. Laguna, you've changed. <laughs> 